I think anyone who is feeling unfulfilled, feeling alone, feeling unhappy, feeling hopeless, depressed is kind of the word we like to use in modern America. I think any of us who describe our life that way are in survival mode. And what's so tragic to me is that we've sort of been taught to settle for that and believe that that's the best we can hope for. That life is hard and, you know, some people get lucky, but most of us just suffer and struggle. Life is hard. And so few of us understand how self-empowered we are, how many resources we have all around us how much life is a, a proactive participatory experience rather than one that's only in receiving mode. And I think like we are wired for survival, of course. So that's, that is the default when stuff gets hard, but we've also been taught and programmed and modeled that that's the best you can hope for. And what's really important for me, and I'm so grateful for your work, your work, Warwick, and others like us who are preaching this gospel of there is more than the thing that happened to you, right? Jung said, I am not what has happened to me. I am what I wish to become or what I choose to become. Mm. And I think it's so often that we in America, in the modern day, are so quick to still completely identify with our hardships rather than identifying those as one moment in the time of our life.